Hey yo guys, how the fuck are you? Trust that you guys are doing amazing. It's your brother Paul, aka Peter Pan. And here we are in the bathroom. Let's get a decent camera position. I probably should have done this before I started recording. But um, fuck it. Take imperfect action. Okay. Take imperfect action. So guys, what are we gonna talk about? <laughs> Aside from me, <laughs> um, think we're like reconsidering when I should have started recording. We're gonna talk about a principle, an action step that I personally took to manifest moolah or cash. And even though it's still getting there, I'm, I'm getting better at this thing as I keep practicing. Um, it's just like I got better at muscle. I just had to keep practicing. I had to keep learning more how the skill works. Just like how you get better at any other skill. I got better at rapping, practicing, learning how the stuff works. Got better at understanding confidence, understanding being charming and attractive and stuff like that. As humble as it sounds to say that. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, things of that nature. Okay. Got better at game and things like that. Whatever the fuck that is. Not fucking playing fucking around, okay, bro. Um, all of these things you can get better at. They are skills, okay. Now, in the same way with manifesting money, fucking skill, bro. Skr, skr, skr. It's a skill, bro, bro, bro. So you're probably asking me, yo, Paul, like Peter Pan, bro, HSG. Spill the knowledge, man. Spill, spill the knowledge, fam. Okay, guys, I'm gonna hit you with the knowledge right now. Bah. Here it is. Um, <clears throat> throughout our day, we're constantly manifesting. We're constantly creating and generating our world. We're constantly um, creating the stuff that happens around us, okay? Um, that's a bit of a deeper topic to get into if you have any fucking questions on it. Oh, no, I said fucking on it, bro. <laughs> if you have any questions, feel free to um, deposit them into the comment section, okay? Is that NLP? <laughs> I'm playing. Feel free to put them in the comment section. And uh, maybe I'll touch on them in the next video. So, with the money thing, it's like this, right? As you guys may have learned from the previous videos, um, I manifested a free 50 bucks. And then the other one was a 50 bucks for working over there. I don't think I mentioned that one, eh? And then the 50 bucks isn't rand, okay? It's not dollars, okay? It's maybe around four dollars, let's say five dollars, okay? Um, and then I told you guys about that offer that I got for writing a verse on one dude's song, a rap verse. I got uh, it was 250 the money that he offered to pay me, but like obviously you send it through the bank and there's like a whatever it is charge, whatever the fuck it's called. And I got like 211, 211 bucks. So. Uh, for doing what I always fucking do anyway, record raps. So that's dope. Anyways, uh, that money came in, was it today or yesterday? I think it was yesterday. It is the yesterday or today, okay? <laughs> dates and stuff are not all that important to me. What's important is that I'm happy and sometimes dates are important to me. Um, so, yeah. So here it is, guys. Okay, perfect. I actually just came up with the. Uh, I just paused to like calm myself and stuff like that. So, um, <laughs> I don't know if you heard that. I hope you did hear it. So, okay, I'm fucking around again. <laughs> I was just being a ventriloquist with my asshole. <laughs> okay, I farted, okay? God, I just came straight off the dome. So, pardon me. Um, anyways, so think of it like this. There's a couple, there's three keys to it, right? So, or ingredients to it. So if you can think of your manifestation as a milkshake or like a, a green smoothie shake, or even if you want to be unhealthy about it, like think of a Tinky or a Twinkie, whatever it's called, right? Whatever people are eating these days, okay? It sounds like a Jason Capital thing to say. Anyway, you should understand. Blessings. Um, I'm faithful. <laughs> Sorry, this ADHD type vibe. <laughs> I'm just playing guys so um <laughs> entertaining myself uh 
Okay, so emotion or vibration, um, action and intention, okay? So, or you can think of action as do unto others as you want others to do unto you type of vibe. So anyway, um, so intention is basically like, okay, so you've got this stuff that you you choose for the other the outer picture to be. So what I would do is I would listen to affirmations through my earphones, right guys? I remember I would be just like throughout the day, I would listen to these affirmations that I made. And it would go something along the lines of uh, money flows to me easily, I make money easily, um, I make lots of money through my rapping. That's actually the one I was listening to previously. And now that's the that's gonna be the the outer covering of the Twinkie or the Tinky, or that's going to be the appearance of the milkshake. You get what I'm saying? Or the green smoothie. That's going to be how it looks on the outside. Okay. Um, now, now we've got the outside. Okay. We've got the decorations and stuff. Now we're going to do the filling. Okay. We're going to do the, this is a metaphor guys, metaphorically speaking. So we're going to choose a filling for the Twinkie or the Tinky <laughs> and for the milkshake or whatever it is. So the emotion or the vibration is where that comes in, okay? So we've got our affirmation that we're listening to, which is money flows to me easily and all this stuff and I make money, blah, 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 blah. So we've got, first of all, we've got good intentions, which is doing unto others as we want others to do unto us, okay? Um, regardless of whether we think that they are right or wrong, always treat people with kindness, um, have mercy, bro, like be kind. Um, because you might not, you, be, you might be misinterpreting them, okay? Um, and by the way, when you fix your vibration, your emotional state, what happens is you gain insight to looking at things in ways that you weren't looking at it before, as you go higher in like your way of feeling within your body. So you'll be able to consider things from other people's perspectives in a way that you weren't able to do it the previous time, okay? And then things will make much more sense and you'll realize, like this is a side tangent, but it's pretty fucking useful. You'll realize that, wow, people aren't as unreasonable as I initially thought. No, 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 they're not. They're not unreason as unreasonable as we initially thought. They have their own perspective, just like you have your own perspective, okay? And um, generally, people think that what they're doing is right, okay? Generally. Generally, they have some justification in their mind, whether you agree with it or not. You've got your justifications, whether they agree with it or not, okay? Um, so just treat people with love and care and try to understand um, and... Increase your vibration, your presence currency. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we can talk about how to do that. But okay, back to the money manifesting. So, if the emotion and or the vibration or your presence currency is going to be what fills the Tinky or Twinkie or the milkshake, um, that's going to be like, if you fill yourself with good emotions, whatever emotions you're putting within yourself or vibration you're putting within yourself, that is what's going into that manifestation. Okay. So you've already got your intention, which is you want more money, right? You want money. So how do you feel about that topic? Right? So you've got, so let's say, okay, let me tell you what I actually like, what I literally did and I'll show you how it kind of came together. So I was listening to books, uh, the science of getting rich. I was listening to it. And when I was listening to it, guys, I remember I already had been listening to my affirmations prior. So now I'm listening to this book talking about money. I think it was, Anyway, <laughs> off his name. So, as I was listening, I started like, there were parts that I was like nodding my head to, and I was like, this is fucking dope, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's get it. And I felt a blissful curiosity to in this whole thing. I was just enjoying myself. It was like a little journey for me. And I was enjoying myself. There was a bit of passion in there as I was listening to this audiobook. And I got into a flow, state of flow, okay? And flow helps you with manifesting things. It's, it's a positive vibration type of vibe. Uh, you can just categorize it in that, <laughs> that type of, give it that type of um, aspect to it, whatever it is. Put it in that category, okay? Of good stuff, good vibes. So, me creating those good emotions within me. And I already had the outer covering or like the, the intention or whatever. What happened was later on that same day, guys, that same day, okay, I had gathered enough emotional resources or presence currency that that same day 
I that's when I got the um the three fifty rand, which is maybe four dollars, five dollars. And then for my dad, that he gave it to me uh, to go and buy like a SIM card, and he told me I can keep the change, which happened to be like forty nine rand. Yeah, so uh, free cash pretty much. Um, and in the past, they weren't like giving me money; like it wasn't, it wasn't um, a common thing. Um, even after I stopped working at the center, like it still wasn't a common thing. It was after I, when I was listening to these affirmations and stuff and doing these things that I'm mentioning to you guys, that was when these things started happening. The money started coming in. Um, so more, okay. So much more, like okay. So <laughs> That, that emotion, that good, blissful emotion, that stuff, that full, that intention that I had, those affirmations, and then boom, there's the 50. This is my understanding of them. This is how I've experienced it. That 50 presented itself to me as an offering. Like, it's offered. Here, you can take it if you want. And then, thank you. And then I got the offer of the music thing, like the 250 rand for doing the verse. And um, that was probably response. That was caused by, because of the affirmation I was listening to, which was, I make lots of money through my rapping, okay? So, yeah, guys, it's about bowling. Like, you listen to your affirmations and stuff, maybe when you lay down or whatever, when you go about your business, whatever. Um, but then you want to have time where you are. Like, throughout the day, by the way, you want to get better at this. And this is something I've been, like, sharpening. I've been honing my skills in at this, guys, is feeling generally at ease throughout the day. Even if you're not feeling excited or hyped up, but you're just feeling okay. Are you feeling good? Good? Between good and okay, okay? And you want to keep it between good and okay. What happens when you do this, like, side note, is, yes, <laughs> side note, that was, fuck, that was a PS sniper. Taste it. Anyway. Side note, what happens is, you're going to make your life easier because your emotions are going to be reflected in your outer environment by the circumstances, uh, whether your boss or whoever you work for or whatever, ask you to do an extra hour of work or whether he gives you the day off or whether he just takes it easy on you or whether um, you get a meet a friend from back in the day and you guys are just so excited about meeting each other. These events and stuff, they are charged by the emotions and the vibrations that you are putting into the world. You're creating from within you, okay? And there's ways to, like, so you can, so it's all good, right? It's all good. Ultimately, what you want to do is just, like, be chilled and relaxed, okay? So how to be children relaxed, um, you can feel free to ask me that question in the comment section if you want me to elaborate on it. But I'll give you just a quick little um, thing that helps me. And by the way, uh, when you do this, <laughs> my facial expressions, when you do this, it gets you, it increases your vibration a bit, okay? So if you do it consistently enough throughout the day, what's going to happen is you're going to go, but in my experience, you're going to go a bit above just feeling okay and just feeling good and you can feel start to feel nice you can start to feel mm, this is nice this is fun you can start to, you gain more creativity also there's a bunch of like benefits and it's not just for the now it's also for afterwards as well for the medium term and long term longer term and the stuff you're attracting so let's get into it um if you feel any emotion in your body whatever it is good or not good so uh so let's just say it like this. You see, the thing is, feeling good is your natural state of being. Okay, it's your natural state of being. So naturally, you're just gonna feel good. Um, if you're not feeling good, there's something in the way. There's something in the way. Okay. So whatever's whatever emotions in the way. Okay, emotion. I'm not talking about thoughts. Let go of thoughts. We're talking about emotions here. So if you feel some emotion in your body, whether it's tightness or some not nice feeling, some, then you put your awareness onto that or how it. Not put your awareness, but you just feel how it feels. This is what I do. It works pretty fucking well. So, um, you feel how it feels. And then, just like when you come back home from school and you just lay on your bed, like you put your school bag down and just lay on your bed. Like, ah, oh, feel so good to just chill on this bed and just lay like that. Um, uh, <laughs> thought of a joke now. Oh, they're not going to say it. So, um, in prone, when you're in prone, you're just laying like this in prone position, right? Which is actually one of my favorite positions because I feel like it's just like a beautiful view. Just, okay, now, <laughs> that's, you see, 
Anyways, guys, hey, I'm gonna vibe tonight, okay? Um, I appreciate my wife. I appreciate her. I think she would be, she just blushes this joke a lot, but it's so bad. Okay, I'm gonna relax. So, guys, um, So in the same way, when you when you come to a, a resort or whatever, or a fancy hotel, and there's like a beautiful blue swimming pool, and there's that recliner, when you lay on it, that feeling of relax, relaxing and just almost sinking into the seat or whatever it is, or just chilling on the seat and just like being at ease, that same feeling of enjoying the feeling of touching the seat, it's a similar vibe when you have whatever emotion or whatever inside of you, and then you just feel it, and then you just put your awareness on it and you just feel it, you just relax on it. And what happens is it starts to dissipate, it goes like um, And if your awareness goes back to thoughts or whatever, like take your awareness or what, like just bring it back, just bring it back to that emotion and then just like starts to dissipate. And um, how I actually experience it is like a That's how I actually experience it. I actually hear sounds in my body. Um, it's, pretty, it's a relieving feeling. You feel at ease, you feel relaxed, you feel relieved. Um, it's good. And so you kind of clear that out. You can actually watch a video called, there's this dude, I think his name is Yongapur, Y-O-N-G-A-P-U-R. Um, he's a monk, Buddhist monk. So he talks about how to dissipate that emotion. Okay. He talks about how to dissipate it. And, um, how to get that clearness, that relaxing, that just total ease and tranquility, that serenity in your body, okay, and in your mind. So, you to find him, you can type in like meditation is easy, and then type in Buddhist monk next to it or monk next to it. I think you should find it like that on YouTube. Here on the YouTube's, okay. So yeah, that's a you you'll find some of his videos until you find the one that he talks about dissipating emotions and calming down and relaxing, okay. So, um, if you really want, you can ask me, type in a question or on the comment section in there and, um, for the link and I'll see if I can find the video and send you the link. Okay. It's really helpful. So now that you've cleared out your emotions, now it's, now you can also, here's the thing guys, to make yourself feel better and charge of those positive emotions is enjoying what you have right now. Gratitude, right? And it's not always just gratitude, like, oh, thank you, universe, for this wonderful phone, okay? You want to start with smaller things, right? Um, that way you can get momentum and actually feel gratitude. And you can actually feel good about it. So, and it's not always about mouthing it or voicing it, but, like, the key is to enjoy it and to appreciate it. So, for example, I'm touching the phone. I'm at the point right now, oh, yo, check it out, check it out, check it out. Um... My wife, man, when we, I'm not wearing my ring right now, but some, some videos I wear it. When we were, I'm actually going to visit her soon in Slangrafi. Fuck yes. Okay. Um, she, I'm going there on the 21st. Okay. She went there on the 15th. I'm going there on the 21st to meet her and the family. It's going to be awesome. So <clears throat> sometimes when we're chilling together, we were here at the dormitory in Wellington and just like sitting, right? I would like smell a hair or something like that. And just that like smelling, the smell of it and just being there and experiencing it. I was like, and it's not that it necessarily was like, because she was using some weird, well, not weird, but like um, not stereotypically pleasant smelling uh, hair product, whatever it is for her hair to make it soft and stuff. So, but for me, I was like taking it in, taking it in. I was enjoying it. Yeah, I know. It's like some. I'm like a pervert, okay, I'm a pervert. <laughs> um, but it's a fun joke for me, okay? And I take joy in it in a way, knowing that I'm attra an, attract an attractive uh, pervert. So <laughs> I'm speaking about that. okay, I'm just joking so much. But anyways, guys, so I'll be smelling your hair. She'll be like, oh, what's what's up with my hair? Like, is everything okay? Like, what's going on? And I'm like, no, no, I'm enjoying it. I'm actually enjoying it. Um, and she knows how it smells, though, I'm assuming. So that's probably why she's asking that question. But I still enjoy it and I'm appreciating that small thing. And what happens is when you learn to appreciate small things, like for example, when you're standing in the grocery store, that's what I was doing the other time, right? I was waiting in line at the queue and 
just enjoying like some people were rushing like doing whatever some people were chilled i don't know what the case may be but i was enjoying that moment guys just being there knowing that everything in this moment is perfectly fine oh there's just so much ease and just to enjoy that that's a form of gratitude that's like enjoying appreciating being able to savor it just like oh. and then you can start to say thank you to the universe from inside and that can amplify it a little bit it's great so doing that type of thing, that's increasing, that's boosting your state. And so what happens when you do that, guys, is something awesome happens, okay? You start to, the law of attraction, right? You start to attract more um, opportunities for yourself to enjoy similar things that are a little bit larger in scale, okay? So next time you might just be walking and then you feel a nice breeze or something. And here's another opportunity for you to... Take it in and just enjoy it. And then as you keep going, you go next time. It's a meal that you're eating. You enjoy the fried chicken, the watermelon, and the Kool-Aid. And mm, how proud your ancestors will be coming from Africa. It's like, yeah, I'm fucking around. I'm from Africa too. So are my ancestors. Skirt, skirt, skirt. Certain, certain ancestors. Skirt, skirt, skirt. Okay. Dang, dang. <laughs> so, um, yeah, guys. So, when you... <laughs> When you can enjoy those smaller things, it becomes easier for you to be grateful for the larger things. And what you're doing is you are now charging up your vibrational state and you're starting to attract more good things towards you. And those, you're going to notice you in, within you, right? Your frequency, your vibration is going to start bringing in more good things as you raise it from within yourself. It's fucking beautiful, bro. It's beautiful. Here's a uh, verse from the Bible, right? Seek first the kingdom of heaven and all these things shall be added unto you. Okay, seek first the kingdom of heaven. Heaven, okay? And all these things shall be added unto you. You seek it first within yourself, within yourself, and you attract these awesome things towards you, okay? These awesome, all these things shall be added unto you, okay? Um, <laughs> so yeah, guys, um, the joy of the Lord is my strength, okay? You create this joy within you, okay? He who uh, walks in the Lord's ways will be like a, a tree planted by a river or a stream and will, will be growing from that stream. Like that's, I'm paraphrasing one of the verses, right? I went to Sunday school, okay? I'm basically an expert. <laughs> I'm kidding. I studied uh, quite a lot. I went to how many courses did I go to? I went any fucking way, discipling, discipling schools and stuff like that. So anyways, back to swearing. Fucking... You know what? Wait, wait. If I'm gonna swear, I, I'm gonna. I should articulate like my swear words. So fucking, fucking. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I came up with that joke outside. I was like, that's genius. Um. So, anyways, yeah, guys. And one thing that helped me, like, okay, so I'm just gonna list out some stuff that helps dopely. Okay, that helps great. So, listening to audiobooks, things that you're passionate about, and just getting almost like in. Immersing yourself in a world where you can just like forget about the other stuff, like forget about the money and things like that, like just let go of it and just be here, present to the moment, enjoying um, whatever it is. Maybe a video game, right? Where you're feeling relaxed. Remember, being relaxed is important. Don't be like, oh, I gotta win this level. Oh my god, no, bro, no, no, oh, I gotta win this level. Oh my god, I'll be back. <laughs> Kidding, shout out to Arnold. Um, dope guy. So, you want to be. At the point where it's like you're enjoying it, right? Uh, books, right? Audiobooks. I love listening to audiobooks that teach me something that I'm interested in and I actually give a fuck about. Um, I feel like swearing will engage my listeners more. <laughs> Note to self. <laughs> um, <laughs> another one, listening to music, guys. Yo, just today I actually thought of myself while I was watering the fountains. Like my dad asked me, um, he said, Hey, did you water? those your mother's plants over there i was like no i didn't even i started watering them um you see me attracting going in okay i'm not gonna go over that and just gloss over that but i, I caused that okay um <laughs> be more responsible with my vibration okay anyways but while i was busy watering it i realized i was listening to like i think celine dion um alive is the name of the song and i, I realized to myself yo i see the value of music right now like i see it like it's not just momentarily uh, 
pleasure in the moment that's like semi pointless no it's like it helps you not only now by letting you feel good and stuff it also helps you like right afterwards and then and it helps your health it helps your vibration which attracts good stuff towards you you know guys here's another thing by the way a side tip tip um <laughs> your emotions influence your well-being okay your health okay when you great vibration emotional state your body can regenerate itself be do its natural things it has its natural circulation like blood circulating through your body right you're feeling good circulating through you when you feel that naturalness that goodness like everything's right you feel like this is the way things are supposed to be everything's lining up everything feels good everything feels perfect this is how it's supposed to be there's a reason why you feel like that's the way it's supposed to be because kind of is okay is okay you're supposed to be happy you're supposed to be joyful okay i made a video called you are happiness as child okay you can check that out if you want more info on that topic so um so yeah get that <laughs> music okay i'm trying to stay on track here so music guys it's pretty easy to stay on track right now the other one is um conversations with people okay having fun yo one of my favorites guys is when i go to town just smiling at people just like enjoying like as i'm walking and i've kind of developed the mindset and um, i speak about this in a lot of my videos feeling the ground feeling your feet touching the ground when you walk or your shoes uh feeling your air going through your nostrils like hearing the sounds okay these things and the, my most favorite one is to like feel the touch sensations okay and then I go to listen to the hearing and then smell. It's also a nice one. And then taste. And then um, sometimes 